We begin with our breaking news. Hi, everyone. I'm Yuki Washington. And I'm Jessica Cartaglia. There are new developments in the investigation of some racist online posts by Philadelphia police officers. Commissioner Richard Ross is holding a news conference. He says 72 officers have now been placed on administrative leave pending an investigation. Ross is speaking after meeting with organizers of the Rally for Justice protest this afternoon. They want all of the nearly 330 officers accused of racist and violent posts on social media assigned to desk duty pending an investigation. The commissioner says the independent law firm helping to conduct the investigation continues to do its work. The independent law firm, Ballard Spar, will concurrently evaluate each post to determine whether the speech was protected under the First Amendment or not. Prior to any discipline in the, the cases, it will be cross-referenced with the findings of the independent law firm. If the speech was deter determined to be protected, no further action will be taken. An example would be an opinion on a matter of public concern. That may be an unpopular, well, or may be unpopular, but that does not include threats of violence or pejorative language against any protective class. If the speech is not protected by the First Amendment, the case will proceed with appropriate discipline. The watchdog group Plain View Project discovered the controversial posts of police officers who work in Philly and in other cities around the country. We'll have more in a live report coming up at 530.